23 years ago, the alien Ceph invaded our world. We stopped them. I stopped them. But the Cell Corporation seized the opportunity, stepping into the power vacuum, quickly growing in size and influence to the brink of world domination. Cell took us all by surprise. Even me. They call me Prophet. And I'm the only one who knows what's coming. Cell are not the real threat to our world. The most powerful alien, the Alpha Seth, still lives. He showed me a glimpse of the future. He knows what drives me, what I believe. That being a good soldier comes down to one thing, to one single question. What are you prepared to sacrifice? Remember me. When they came to me with the nano suit, I sacrificed Lawrence Barnes, the man I was, to become prophet. When my own flesh and blood held me back, I sacrificed that too, replaced it like a spare part. Victory costs. Every time you pay a little more. I saw a glimpse of what's coming. and there was nothing left of me to stop it. When the greatest combat machine fails, what do we do then? What do I? Whoa, 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 easy! Friendlies! 
You remember friendlies. Psycho. Oh. Oh. Where's your nano suit? Cell skinned me. Skinned us all. You're the last one. It's all about that suit now. Hardware is intact. Initiating terminal velocity. Copy that, Romeo-1. You have cleared the perimeter. The Liberty Dome is designed to contain a Ceph threat. You have the advantage. Cell units are organizing their response. We estimate you have about uh, 30 minutes. The highlighted area is still a go. Cell ground activity is minimal here, but the towers are still 100% functional. Stay safe and bring that hardware home, Romeo-1. That was a bit messy. Maybe you need this. A bowl? Yeah. Makes you an invisible, silent killing machine. Serious kitness. You like it? No. Well, that's because you haven't heard the good part. Carbon lasers map that bow to your nanosuit. It has enough kinetic energy to stop a rhino dead. With interchangeable heads, you can drop an explosive charge on any target. And best of all, you stay cloaked. You like it now? I'm coming around. Good. Now let's move out. Let's go. Romeo 1, we've breached Fo Foxtrot 4. Burnout prepped and ready, over. Nice one. Critical threat. Sustained wind speeds exceeding operational limits along the east dome. He disappeared!
What the hell are we walking into? This is Cell's home front. They got about one, maybe two thousand. In the Seth? Come on, mate. The aliens are finished. You should know that by now. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Come on, Cycle, let's move. Show me your face. You cut me out of my fucking soap. Now show me your face. Cycle, let's go. I will find you. I will fucking find you! You're awake when they cut you out, you know. A lot of the lads died screaming. Their hearts gave up from the shock. Signature. Why is that? It's Cell. They're channeling energy from alien technology, running their entire global power grid off a single Ceph machine inside this dome. It can't be that simple. It really is, mate. You kill the power, you kill Cell. As simple as you like. No, the Alpha Ceph showed me a vision. We've been through this before. There's got to be a connection somehow. Prophet. The aliens are gone. You finished them off yourself, just a few waifs and strays left. No, there's something more. If we can just find a hint, somewhere here, a clue. Listen, while you were off hunting some super alien that didn't even exist, Cell were busy taking over the world. We need you back in the here and now, boss. We need you to help us stop Cell. There's more than your revolution going on here. I've seen this. Cell are toying with powers they can't begin to understand. Whatever they're doing, it's going to bring about the end of the world. We have to shut them down. Fucking right we do. Let's get moving. Street Station. Couple of clicks. We'll have to get around the kill zone first. No. Cell are closing in. There's no time to go around. The kill radius and rate of fire is within manageable parameters. We can cut straight through this. You hear that, you bastards? Yeah, I'll tell you all on, yeah, come on! Let's have your eye, come on! <laughs> Are you insane? Those guns will rip you apart! Ah, so now you get the picture. They took my nanosuit, Prophet. I'm human! Human? You know how much I've sacrificed to stop the Seth. How do I get that back? So what's your plan? Support. Designate and execute targets. 
It too. You do the fun stuff. That's not the psycho I used to know. Things change. Okay, this is how it's gonna work. I'll call out the locations as I see them. Like this one in Sector 1, Delta Zero. These are potential cache locations. Our primary target is Tower 3, Delta 3. As soon as you get the hardware, we'll knock the bastard out cold. Sector 1, Delta 3. Looks good. There. Sector 1, Delta Zero. Sector 1, Delta 2. Got something. and out of sight of the tower. I thought that would be fucking obvious. That's it. Recon what we have, and let's move on to the next sector. Nothing here. Delta 3 has been disabled. Response units relocate to that sector immediately. Give me an update on your position. Let's link up. Roger that. Enemy ICOM chatter indicates they're still in the area. How copy? Those electric arrowheads you got can light up a large area. Try them out in the lake there. Heads up. 
Profit. Sell reinforcements en route. Security lockdown in effect. Edge up. Cell weapons drop near your location. Primary asset, asset has been destroyed. How the hell did you get this thing open? Use your security chip on the front panel. I did that already. Think I'm some kind of moron? Yep. Insurgent activity reported in, in position, structure. waiting on you. How'd you find that gun? It's not important. Those visions. 
people aren't even sure what or who you are anymore. What do you believe? I'm here, aren't I? Jump over here. You're the one in the dive suit. I guess they heard us. What the fuck happened here? Check their black boxes. Find out how they died. I'm going topside. See what's going on. Typical HQ bullshit. I can't open up that tunnel. Yeah? Well, I fucking can. Come on. Give it a push. The train is full of highly explosive material. Yep. Oh, yeah. This is 
your plan? Yeah! Come on, you bastards! I don't know about you, but I call that fucking flawless. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Shit. Sweetheart. Your number one soldier on the line. Open a window to the safe house. ETA 10 minutes. Romeo 1, Romeo Actual. You will maintain radio protocol. Now bring that hardware home. Over and out. Let's go. What a hard ass. Listen, she's all right when you get to know her. Just don't mention the visions, okay? Psycho? Why does she keep calling me hardware? Welcome to our humble abode. So they're always on our tail. We have to move around like no mat. Well, you get the picture. Shit! All units, outpost to reach a blow. Fall back to the green line. Stay mobile. Hello, sweetheart. Hold on, Michael. I'll be with you in a moment. Welcome home. Cell is hammering us with digital artillery. Our network is being torn apart. Get us back online now. Damn it. Clear. Using reflectors to bounce the signal. Yeah, I don't give a shit. We need to get back online. Clear. God, Michael. What a day. We lost some good people. I was trying to contact Dane when... What the... Oh, no. No, no. Claire, this is Prophet, my CO from... Look at the modifications, Michael! Is it Seth? Cell? Is it even human? Have we been sacrificing good people for that... that... mutation? Look! This is not just a suit, Michael! Claire! Claire... Five months now we've been here. The balance of asymmetrical warfare favors us less every day. This was meant to be our Normandy, but alas, here we are in hiding. We nibble here, we nibble there, but we can't turn the tide, we can't build momentum. We need a game changer. Major Lawrence Barnes, the Prophet, Karl Ernst Rasch. Rash, I remember you. Hold still, please. Recombinant DNA. Human. Seth. Synthetic. Incredible. I can't get a read on you. Oh. Come now, Lawrence, what did you expect? I designed your suit, my dear fellow, of course. It can't get a read on me.
class right, you know, about the risk. So much power, but volatile and willful fractures. Tell me, did Michael brief you on our plans? I'll brief him when we move out, sir. It's brilliant, boss. This will cripple Cell for good. The situation is far worse than any of you can imagine. I have visions, glimpses of... Ugh. We will take the fight to Cell. Shut down that energy nexus and end all this, or whatever they're doing will bring about the extinction of all life on this planet. Remember that. You sound quite prophetic. Is that intentional? It's very apropos. Now, let's go save the species. Shall we? Right then. Let's move out. Watch yourself. You know I will. Let's go. Romeo 1, we've gained a 60-minute window on the primary target. You have multiple cell units moving on your position. Do not jeopardize the goddamn mission now. Psycho, I'm in. Hacking the cell security overrides now. Emergency power shutdown system request. Emergency power shutdown. Release control rod to shut down system. Emergency shutdown in effect. Switching to backup generators. Projecting System X containment view. Warning. System X containment failed. What? No. They couldn't have been that stupid. source was the Alpha Seth. Oh, fuck me. If your visions are real, does that mean it's end of the world time? No. It means the bastard's out in the open. It means I can kill him. Just scraped this from Cell's databanks. Looks like we just broke out their biggest secret. That creature was the source of Cell's energy. The Alpha Seth. 
He's way more powerful than I expected. But when I was near him, I saw things the Seth didn't want me to see. If they can get into my head, maybe I can get into theirs and find a weakness. Psycho, you know of a suit cradle nearby? Yeah. At the skinning lab where Cell held me. Let's link up there in 30 mics. Be careful in there, Michael. There are some things you can never forgive. We just deployed in the swamp. Affirmative, moving to sector. All quiet. You hear that? All clear over here. False alarm. Understood. Resume perimeter sweep. No visible target. Moving to next checkpoint. Something there? Must be nothing. Here too. No, no sign of profit. Call it in. Blacktail Actual, this is Blacktail Niner. Delancey 4 Alpha is clear. Moving to the next squadron. Over. Negative, Blacktail Niner. Condition Red Star Rising has been initiated Fuck. by next. Over. Red Star Rising, please confirm that this is not a mistake. Over. Confirm. Red Star Rising has been set. Over. No, shit, shit, shit. What are they thinking? Red Star Rising? What's wrong with them? I don't know. Screw Prophet. Let's get out of here. Hey! What about Steber? Fuck him. He'll catch up. You heard of this Red Star Rising, Psycho? No. Never. Cell don't spook easily. Find out what you can. Always gonna lead the fighting to me. Listen, there's not a single day goes by where I don't wish I was you. Even with all that God knows what hardware, wetware, Seth mutation bullshit going on under that skin of yours, I take it. Come on. Win? 
Yep. Halfways. Calibrating sensor remotes. Slight delay. Compensating. We're in. Locked. Have a seat, mate. To be sure about this. Unlocking the suit means breaking the safety seals, rerouting the nanites. If he's infused with Ceph technology now, there's no telling what he'll become. You can handle this, right, boss? Do it. I'm accessing the memory retrieval systems. Filtering. Dopamine blockers are cleared. I'm registering critical neurological changes. You should be able to make a clear link with the Ceph now. What's this? Michael, you shouldn't. Don't. Why not? It won't help. Operation. The nanosuit is then fully removed. Subject 8A, Sergeant Michael Seitz, is... Uh, is still functioning at near optimal levels, but accelerated degradation is to be expected. You did this to me. Michael, please listen to me. You are the reason why. I, I mean, I fight Cell because of you. Because. Is that what you cared? Or were you pretending to care because of this? Because of your own fucking guilt? I didn't have a choice, Michael! The cell program, we were in debt, you know how this works. I was forced to do this. To all of those people. I had to listen to their screams day after day after day. I know what I did. Jesus, believe me, I know. And I'll have to carry that with me as long as I live. Every day of my life. Michael! And feeling bad about it makes it all right, does it? If you're so fucking sorry, Claire, how come I had to find out like this? Why didn't you just come clean, you lying Michael, fuck? listen to me. You know how it works. You know she didn't have a choice. She did what she had to do. No choice. Just doing what she's told. Just following orders. Who the fuck does that sound like, Prophet? I'll tell you one thing though, she was right about you. You might as well be a fucking machine because you sure as hell ain't no human being anymore. I mean, you never were much good at it to begin with, but Jesus Christ, look at you now! Whose face are you wearing under that helmet these days, Prophet? Do you even have a face anymore? We all had to make sacrifices. You had a choice, mate. Everyone has a choice. Look, I told you. Everything you needed to know. Remember these. All the men who died under your command because you were just following orders. Because you had no choice. Just like her. Psycho. No, mate. You take that suit of yours. And you go fight your own battles. Like all. Mike, wait. No, Claire. He's right. Let him go.
Oh, God. We just got intel on Red Star Rising. Listen carefully. Archangel is a key regulator platform in Cell's new wireless energy grid. But that's not all it does. Why can't Cell stay out of my goddamn way? I need to get everyone out to the perimeter. You're wasting your time. I have to save as many lives as I can. No, it won't matter. It's not gonna be like Linkshan. Archangel has a massive global energy store. They feed all that power back into the Alpha Sep and it'll punch one hell of a hole in the earth. There'll be no earth left. So what can we do? Connect to a Ceph mine carrier. If I can get inside their heads, maybe I can reverse the awakening, put them all back to sleep. If there's no Ceph threat, Cell will call off Archangel. You're going to link yourself to the Ceph? Prophet, you struggled to resist their influence even when your mind was protected. We've turned those safeties off now. That means the nanites in your suit are free. That means they can transform into anything, any form imaginable. You could actually become a Seth. That's a risk I'm willing to take.
My children were mindless while I slept. Shutting down Archangel was the last thing I needed from you. And for that I must thank you. What? What are you talking about? Rash! Rejecting stage 3 simulation. The third and final stage. The beam! It's powering... Oh my god. It's an Einstein Rosenbridge. A goddamn wormhole to the M33 galaxy. And there's something big coming through. Back in the safe house, when I couldn't get a read on you, you said it was because you were the suit's creator. But that's not it, is it? How long has it been going on? Extending your life with nanotech, with Ceph DNA. Do you have any idea what you've become? You were battling the Sep hive mind, just like me. Except you lost. They absorbed you. And now you're one of them. final and most deadly element of the Ceph colonization strategy. If met with significant and persistent resistance, a Ceph Cycle. 
Psycho, I'm sorry, but we don't have much time. We need to find another VTOL now. Psycho, don't you fucking call me that! We have to shut that energy beam down, Psycho, or everyone is going to die. Do you understand me? And what the fuck am I supposed to do about it, eh? I'm Michael Sykes. I'm just a human prophet. I couldn't even save one fucking life, not one! You selfish son of a bitch! Don't you get it yet? Rash had me pinned back there, kept me locked down because of this damn suit. If you'd been wearing a suit, we'd all be dead. You being human is what saved us. We all human, Psycho. And we all fought. Me, you, Nomad, Jester, all of us. We fought. Not the goddamn nanosuits. Now it's just you and me that's left. We can make a difference. One last mission. Do you think she'd want you to quit now? Level Vulture 4, we need immediate support. Pilot, we're under massive self Can't hold out much. Michael. Michael. Just so we're clear. This is gonna be a slaughter. Too fucking right it is. And I'm gonna be doing the slaughtering. Like you said, boss. I don't need a suit. I don't need tech. I just need bottle, right? You take out the artillery. I'll bring in the veto. Well, go on, mate. It ain't the end of the world. See you on the other side. Intercepting Max encrypted in full stream. Five percent of estimated power apex. Vela 3 satellite has detected Hawking radiation at a distance of 1.2 AU. Solar spread telemetrics indicate white hole formation. I've connected. Artillery is disabled. Bring her in. Roger that, Prophet. I'm en route. Stand by for some serious destruction. She's down. Roger that. Moving to the next AAA. Copy that. We'll hold position. Just give the word. Michael? Where the hell are you?
This suit is mine! to me with the nano suit, I sacrificed Lawrence Barnes, the man I was, to become Prophet. 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 Maybe the greatest tactical combat machine the world has ever known. Just following orders. Is it even human? You might as well be a fucking machine. But when you've sacrificed everything you had to become a perfect, cold, hard, logical machine, and that machine fails, what happens then? But Hold on! Everyone has a choice. When profit fails, what's left? Have something, Prophet. But hold on! Something the Seth will never have or understand. Lawrence! It was never just about the suit! But hold on! Your suit 
There's only one thing he can rely on when the chips are down. Not his cutting edge intel, not his state of the art equipment, not his top of the line weapon, just himself. Took me a long time to remember that. For now, the war is over. I made mistakes along the way, but after all, I'm only human. My name is Lawrence Barnes. They called me 